go ahead and set up your seat for a brief meditation before we get started. You can sit up on a block or a couple of blocks, whatever it takes to get your hips like a little bit higher than your knees. And then sit tall, let your hands rest on your thighs, press the crown of your head towards the sky, and let your eyes come closed. Notice the weight of your body resting on the floor, your sits bones, your feet, your shins pressing into the earth. Take a big breath right here. Sigh it out. Again, take another big breath in. Let it go. Now notice the rise and fall of your chest with your breath in and your breath out. Notice any sounds in the room or outside the room. And bring your attention to your hands. The warmth and weight of your hands resting on your thighs. Send your attention into your thumbs, your first finger, middle finger, ring finger, and baby finger. Notice if any thoughts come up, you get off into thinking. Let your thoughts come up and let them go. And keep your attention on your hands. Keeping your attention on your hands, breathe in for a count of four, three, two, one. Hold it at the top, two, one. Exhale, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale again, four, three, two, one. Hold. Exhale, six, five, four, three, two, one. And do that two more times and keep your attention on your hands. your attention on your hands, bring them to heart center and press your thumbs into your breastbone, sitting tall. Take a big breath in. Exhale it out. Bring your thumb tips to your forehead center, touch in. And then gently flutter your eyes open and make your way to child's pose to begin your practice. Let your knees be extra wide. Give your body lots of space this Saturday morning. Press all of your toenails down. Press your finger pads down into the earth to lift your elbows up off the mat. Squeeze your arms in towards spine line. 
So isometrically create that resistance hugging into the center of your body. Downward facing dog. Press the earth away from you as you press your sits bones high towards the sky. Full breath into your back body. Full exhale out to get present. So I started down listening uh, to a podcast between Russell Brand and Brene Brown the other day. It's about an hour and a half long. Um, and I only made it to 20 minutes in so far. But already, uh, Brene listed off three things that all of us uh, strive for, would love to have in our lives, and are fundamentally important as human beings. Generosity, service, and connection. So can you be generous with your body in today's practice? Let it do what it wants to do. Can your breath be of service to your neighbor? So breathe for somebody else in this room. Breathe for somebody else outside of this room. And can you use your generous behavior towards your body today, the service of your breath for someone else to create a connection in your own body? So look for all of the ways where you can connect all three of those concepts today. Walk your feet to your hands. Take ragdoll pose. Outer edges of your feet parallel with the outer edges of your mat. Press up through your sits bones. Let your head be heavy. Shake your head yes, shake your head no. Take a big breath in. Exhale it out. And catch your hips with your hands. And with a long straight spine, press down through your heels, come up to standing. Hands at heart center. We'll begin with one ohm. Om. Inhale, reach up, look up, extend out through your fingertips. Exhale, forward fold, let it go. Take a big breath in as you halfway lift. Plant your hands, step back to your first high plank and pause. Soft bend to your elbows, pull your belly button in and up, chin out of your chest. Take a big breath right here, fill up. As you exhale, pull forward over your tippy toes, lower halfway down, drop your knees. Upward facing dog, untuck your toes, press them into the earth, lift your thighs, lift your knees, soften your elbows. Downward facing dog, send your hips to the sky. Three breaths, breathe. Generous breath in, a generous breath out. Even here in your downward facing dog, squeeze into spine line, squeeze into the midline of your body. From skin to muscle to bone, hug in. On your next exhale out, bring your knees low, tiger crouch, look towards your thumbs, top of your mat, jump. Halfway lift, breathe in. Forward fold, exhale it out. Extended mountain, root down through the soles of your feet, reach up. Get long through your side body, breathe in. Forward fold, empty your breath out. Halfway lift, create a long spine. Then move through your vinyasa from high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. Two breaths, fill up and empty. Exhale, bend your knees, look to your thumbs, jump, top of your mat. 
halfway lift, forward fold, last sun salutation, a root down, rise up, reach, get big, maybe see the wall behind you, baby back bend, exhale, forward fold, empty all your breath out, halfway lift, breathe in, vinyasa, high to low, upward facing dog, press toes into the earth, breathe, downward facing dog, hips high, Take a breath in here. Bring your knees low. Look to your thumbs. Jump. Top of your mat. Halfway lift. Forward fold. Big toes come to touch. Chair pose. Squeeze into center line. Squeeze inner thighs in. Squeeze knees in. Sit deep. And tilt your tailbone just a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Reach your fingers high towards the sky. Take a big breath in, sit one inch deeper as you exhale it out. Breathe in, forward fold, let it go. Halfway lift, inhale, vinyasa, high to low. Upward facing dog, pull your heart through, breathe in. Downward facing dog, hips high. Take a breath here, let it go. Step your right foot forward for warrior one. Back heel plants. Set up your foundation for your first warrior one. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, right hip pulls back to send left hip forward. Yeah. Square your shoulders towards the front of the room. Radiate your fingers towards the sky. Take a breath, look up, reach up, breathe in. Hands to the mat, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, pull through, breathe in. Downward facing dog, hips high. Left side, left foot forward, warrior one. Big step, root down, rise up. Foundation, stack front knee, front ankle. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, long side body. Take a breath in, reach up. Exhale, hands to the mat. High plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. Breathe in. Bend your knees low. Exhale, slow top of your mat, jump. Halfway lift, forward fold, chair pose, big toes touch, squeeze in, sit deep. Take a breath, radiate your fingers higher, exhale, sit deeper. Full breath in, forward fold, exhale out. Inhale, long spine, high plank, Step, step, low plank, lower halfway down, upward facing dog, breathe in, down dog, let it go, right foot, warrior one, big step, root down, squeeze in, rise up, exhale, hands to the mat, high plank, step, low plank, Upward facing dog, shoulder blades slide down. Downward facing dog, hips high. Left side, warrior one, big step, root to rise. Hands back to the mat, high plank. Vinyasa, flow like water. Move with your breath as you breathe in, push down. Hips high, exhale. Big breath right here. Let it go. We're starting the blood flowing, getting a little warm. So good. Lift your right leg straight back behind you. Flex your foot. Yes. Drop your right hip just a little. Yeah. Now bend your knee. Stack your hips. Send your top foot towards Nebraska. Come up onto your tippy toes. Yeah, flip your dog. Root down through your heels. Reach your fingers towards the fireplace. Breathe in. Reach. 
side plank, left hand center of your mat, roll over to the left hand, knife's edge of your left foot, press down to lift your top foot, flex strong, skin into bone, downward facing dog, let it go. Take a breath here, open your mouth, make some noise, left side, lift your left leg strong and straight, press out through your heel, bend your knee, stack your hips, come up onto the tippy toes of your right toes and flip your dog, left foot comes down to the earth, both feet face 12 o'clock, root down through your heels, reach, look to where your fingers are reaching, feel the opening here for you, side plank, left hand, center of your mat, Pull your belly button in, flex both feet, strong, strong, so good. Downward facing dog, let it go. Big breath in, big breath out. Again, breathe in, let it go. Right foot steps forward, crescent lunge. Squeeze inner thighs in, fire up your legs, oh yeah. Pull your belly button in, your bottom ribs in. Mm-hmm. Can you bring your back heel high up over your tippy toes? Yes, press your hamstring up towards the sky. Take a longer stance with your front leg, look at your toes out a little further, yeah. Reach both hands up towards the sky as you pull your bottom ribs in. Cactus your arms, shoulder blades squeeze together, bottom ribs pull in, twist towards the chakra wall, squeeze, fingers spreading, radiating, squeezing everything into center, come back to center, crescent lunge, reach your arms high towards the sky, open up to warrior two. Yeah, flip your front palm. Reach up, reverse, breathe, breathe, breathe. Extended side angle, forearm to thigh, fingers to earth, yogi's choice. Stack front knee, front toes face 12 o'clock. Take a big breath here. Come back up to warrior two. Stay low. Flip your palm, reach up, reverse, breathe, breathe, breathe. Vinyasa, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, take a big breath in. Downward facing dog, let it go. Left side, left foot steps forward, crescent lunge, big step. Big step, stack back heel over back toes, root down through your left heel. Belly button in, bottom ribs in, squeeze. Press your back hamstring up towards the sky to fire that leg up. Reach your fingers, yes, high. Cactus your arms. Radiate fingers. Twist towards Nebraska. Pull in. Send your energy out your fingernails. Squeeze in. Energy out. Come back to center. Reach your fingers up towards the sky. Breathe. Open up to warrior two. Crack, crack. First open hip posture, lots of cracks. Flip your front palm, reach up, reverse, breathe. Breathe, breathe. Extended side angle, forearm to thigh, fingers to earth. Press your left knee towards your left pinky toe. Breathe, where did the breath go? Breathe. Stay low in your front thigh, root down through your left heel, warrior two. Flip your front palm, reverse, breathe, breathe, breathe. Vinyasa, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, take all that goodness in. Downward facing dog, give some goodness back. Full breath in, make some noise. Again, breathe in, bend your knees low top of your mat, halfway lift, forward fold, 
chair pose, squeeze in, reach fingers high, hands to heart center, chair twist towards the chakra wall, squeeze, elbow to knee, knee to elbow, and then look down, did your left knee creep out in front, squeeze them in, squeeze your belly button in, stack your right shoulder up and over your left, press your heart towards your, your hands towards your heart, Open your wings for a big breath. Forward fold, let it go. Halfway lift, breathe in. Forward fold, let it go. Chair pose, inhale. Hands to heart center. Chair twist to the left. Right elbow, left knee. And then again, look, did your knee creep out? Squeeze them together. Sit your hips lower than your heart. And then open your wings. Right fingers down, left fingers reach. Big breath here. Forward fold, empty out. Toe heel your feet, hips width distance apart. Grab your big toes with your peace fingers. Pull your chest down towards your thighs. Send your elbows wide. Generous bend to your knees. Release your big toes. Take palms to toes, forward fold, gorilla pose. Bring your hands all the way underneath your feet. Bring your toes up to your wrist creases. Bend your knees as much as you need to. Full breath here. Full breath here. Again, full breath. Full breath. Release your gorilla pose and set up for crow pose. You can use your brick as a kickstand if you're working on shifting forward, fingers spread wide, knees come to the backs of your triceps. Pull your belly button in, squeeze toes in towards center. Maybe you bring your forehead down to the brick and then press down into the earth to find that lift. Lift, press down. Squeeze belly button in. Squeeze toes into the center of your mat. Press hands down into the earth. Breathe. Step, step back to a high plank. Move to low plank. Upward facing dog, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. Bring your knees low, tiger crouch, look to your thumbs, jump to where you're looking. Halfway lift, forward fold, catch your hips with your hands, root down, rise up. Take your strap, single, single, single leg raise, right foot in the strap. Root your left foot down into the earth, stretch your toes out on the mat. Standing leg, soft bend to the knee, hug skin to muscle to bone, and then set your drishti. From the ground up, hug in, skin to muscle to bone, bring your right leg, knee into your chest. Shoulder blades pull together, bottom ribs pulling in. Kick your right foot towards the fireplace, pull your right shoulder back into the socket. Left hand to hip, extend your right arm out. Pull belly button in, bottom ribs in, get tall. Extend arm, shift your gaze to your thumb. Come back to center. Take the strap in your left hand, extend your right arm back behind you. And come back to center, drop the strap. Kick your right foot towards the fireplace, flex your foot strong. Strong, strong, airplane arms back by your sides. Right toes point straight down towards the earth. Straight down towards the earth. 
flex your foot strong. Drop your right hip more, more, more. Hands to heart center, half moon. Left hand down to that brick, spider fingers. Stack your top hip up and over. Stomp down through your standing leg to stack your hip. Open up. Reach your right hand towards the sky. Flex your back foot a lot. Press out through the heel. Press out through your heel. Soft bend to your standing knee. Breathe. Let that breath go. Take another breath in. Join both feet on the mat with control and come up to stand. If you look at the floor, you're more stable. Yeah. I, I yeah. Like when you shift your gaze. Mm-hmm. Look up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Strap underneath your left foot. Stretch your right toes out on the mat. Hug in skin to muscle to bone. Intention foundation kick your left foot forward belly button and bottom ribs in tall open your leg out to the side extend your arm see your thumb come back to center take the strap in your right hand left hand reaches back behind you pull your belly button in shift your gaze Come back to center, drop the strap, reach your fingers high, kick your foot, airplane palms face the earth, chin out of your chest, flex your back foot a lot, toes point straight down, drop your left hip. Soft bend to your right knee, hands to heart center, pause, half moon, right hand down to the brick. Squeeze skin to muscle to bone of your standing leg. Pull your belly button in. Intention, foundation, core, hands, and feet. Slowly, slowly send your gaze up to your top fingers. See the ceiling root down through your standing leg as you expand out through your fingers reaching. Take a breath here. Stay for the exhale. Breathe in. Join both feet on the mat and come to stand. Take a breath in. Shake it out, let it go. Dancer pose, right foot roots into the earth. Strap around your left ankle, loose. Same action, toes stretching, skin to muscle to bone of your standing leg, belly button in, bottom ribs in tall. Take the strap behind your head. Press your fist towards the sky as you pull your belly button in, your bottom ribs in. Kick your left toes towards the sky. Wake up your toes. Wake up your foot. Full breath. Five, four, three, two, one with control. And switch sides. Do all of the foundation work, toes stretching, grounding down, hugging in, skin to muscle to bone, pulling into center line, bottom ribs pulling in, right toes are awake and activated, press your fist towards the sky, drop your right hip as you kick your toes towards the sky, pull in to press out, five, four, Three, two, one, with control, and then switch sides. One more set with the strap, without the strap, yogi's choice, dancer pose, switch sides. Let this be a new experience. Let this repeat pose, a place you've been, let this be a new experience and find what it takes for you to fall out of this dancer pose. Go big, close your eyes, 
look up, look down, do something, something to make this 100% brand new. And when you have found your new dancer pose, switch sides. Go there, try it on, whatever it takes. Shifting your gaze, shifting your intention. Find what it takes for you to fall out of this dancer pose. Be okay with being messy. Make peace with messiness. Oh, you have been listening to me. <sighs> uh-huh. Make peace with it. Otherwise, you fight it. It's there with you forever. Release. Come back to standing. Take a breath in. Let it go. And tree pose. Foot presses into ankle, calf, or inner thigh. Belly button pulls in, bottom ribs pull in, get tall. Set your drishti. Squeeze into center line. Then spread your branches, lift your heart towards the sky, lean back, open up. Two, one, hands to heart, center, switch sides. Pull into center line, lift your heart towards the sky, look up, lean back. to heart center, join both feet on the mat. Take a big breath in, exhale, let it go. Root down to your feet, reach up, big breath in. Exhale, forward fold, empty out. Halfway lift, take a big breath in, vinyasa, high to low. Move with your breath. Upward facing dog, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. Step your right foot forward, warrior one. Root down, rise up. Open up to warrior two. Flip your front palm, reach up, reverse, breathe. Straighten your front leg, soft knee. Reach your right fingers towards the front of the room. Get long through your right side body. Prepare for triangle trikonasana. Bring your fingertips to the earth, inside or outside your ankle. Maybe place them on a block. Soft knees, soft knees. Activate your quads, lift your kneecaps. Full breath. Exhale. Left fingertips bring you up to standing. Pivot both toes towards Nebraska. Side facing wide angle forward fold. Hinge, bring your fingertips down. Maybe walk your feet out wider. Bring your fingertips back in line with your toes. Soften your knees. Walk your fingertips out underneath your shoulders. Take a big breath in. Toe heel your feet in just a little bit. Press down, come to stand. Send your right toes to face the fireplace. Set up for pyramid pose. 
Left foot's about halfway up your mat. Both hips are like headlights facing the fireplace. Reach your fingers high towards the sky. Root down through your heels, soft knees. Squeeze into center line. Hinge, reach forward. Keep pressing down through both heels. Send your gaze towards your right pinky toe. Bring your fingertips down to the earth or bricks. Send your nose towards that right pinky toe. Big breath in, big breath out. Twisting triangle, left fingers stay, right fingers reach for the sky. Press down through your back heel. Take a big breath in. Twist, 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 twist. Breath in. Vinyasa, high plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, breath in. Downward facing dog, empty out. Left foot steps forward, warrior one. Step, root, rise, reach up. Open up to warrior two. Press your left knee towards your left pinky toe. Full breath here. Flip your front palm, reach up, reverse, breathe, breathe, breathe. Press down through your left foot, straighten your left leg, soft knee, preparing for triangle. Reach your left fingers forward, forward, forward. Bring them down to the earth or a brick. Spin your left lung under, right lung spins up towards the sky. Full breath here, breathe in. Breathe out, soften your knees. Right fingertips bring you up to standing. Pivot both toes to face the chakra wall, set up for goddess pose. So look down, toes point out, stack knees over ankles. Stack knees over ankles. You can start with your hands on your thighs for starters, and then tilt your tailbone down. So you're going to feel this in your inner groins for sure. Bring your hands to globe hands. Touch your fingertips together. Shoulder blades pull together. Sit deep. Maybe find some side to side movement. Lift your right heel one inch. Lift your left heel one inch. Sit deep. Cactus your arms. Open up. Send your tailbone down towards the earth. Side to side movement for five four, three, two, one, hands to heart center, press down, come to stand, pivot your left toes to face the fireplace, set up for pyramid pose, left side, short stance, wide stance, hips both facing the fireplace, reach your fingertips high, shoulder blades pull down, belly button in, hinge, reach forward, reach forward, reach forward, Frame your foot with your fingers. Send your nose towards that left pinky toe. Twisting triangle. Right fingers stay. Left fingers reach for the sky. Root down through your right heel. Pull your belly button in. Twist, twist, twist. Take a big breath in here at the top. Exhale, hands to the mat. High plank to low plank. Upward facing dog, pull through. Get some new energy. Downward facing dog, hips high. Breathe in, sigh it out. Again, breathe in, let it go. Lift your right leg strong and straight. Toes point straight down towards the earth. Bend your knee, stack your hips, flip your dog. Press down through your heels. Reach your fingers towards the fireplace, peel open. 
full breath. Breathe in. Stay for the exhale. Come back to downward facing dog. Take a breath in. Let it go. Lift your left leg strong and straight. Bend that knee. Stack that hip. Flip your dog. Second set. Feel it newly. Reach your hand forward. Peel your heart open. Lift. Downward facing dog. Let it go. Good work, yogis. Take a breath in. Make some noise. Shift your weight forward into a high plank. Low plank. High plank, press the earth away. Low plank, lower halfway down. High plank, press it away. Low plank, lower down. With control, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Place one ear on the earth. Bring your hands back by your sides, palms facing the earth. Palms facing the earth. Locust pose. With the strength of your back body, press your pubic bone down, rise up, fly, hands, heart, feet, fly. Stay here, let your breath go. Get two inches higher as you breathe in. Let your breath go. Again, rise high, breathe in. Lower all the way down. Big breath in. Exhale it out. Locust pose, second set. Pubic bone presses down. Fly, hands, heart, feet, rise up. Soften your forehead, let your breath go. Breathe in, rise higher. Stay, let your breath go. Last one, squeeze in, rise high. Lower all the way down. Full breath in. Full breath out. Floor bow. Bend your knees, grab your feet, grab your ankles. Squeeze into center line. Yeah, hips width distance with the knees. Squeeze in. Kick. Feet into hands. Pull on feet with your hands. Rise up. Six, five, four, three, two. With control, release. Windshield wiper your legs from side to side. Take a breath in. Let that breath go. And floor bow second set. Second set. Maybe you take your floor bow on a travel this time. Get some momentum going. Rock over to the right side. Kick up. Kick up. Uh -huh. Come back to center. Get the other side. Soften your forehead. Keep waking up your toes. Get the other side. Rock. Come back to center. Release your floor bow. Windshield wiper your legs. Take a breath in. Let it go. Upward facing dog. Soften your elbows. Lift your thighs. Lift your knees by pressing toes into the earth. Four, three, two, one. Downward facing dog hips high. Come down to your knees and set up for camel pose. Toes tucked or untucked, camel pose. Pull your belly button in, your bottom ribs in. Fingertips to the small of your back. Walk your shoulder blades together. Press your hips towards the fireplace. Lift your heart towards the sky. Belly button pulls in, bottom ribs pull in, press down through your knees, your shins, your toes. Soften your throat, soften your forehead. Five, four, three, so good. One, release, sit back on your heels, take a breath in. Exhale it out. And then second set, camel pose. Maybe you tuck your toes this time if you had them untucked last time. Squeeze into center line, belly button, ribs. Lift your heart towards the sky. Lean back. Pull in as you soften and lean back. 
five, four, where can you soften? Two, one, come out of camel, untuck your toes, sit back on your heels, take a breath in, reset, let it go, and then make your way onto your back and set up for bridge pose. Set up for bridge pose. Knees bent, feet firmly into the earth. Reach your arms straight up towards the sky. And then plug your shoulders back into your mat. Make that contact. Feet and knees, hips width distance apart. Press down through your heels. Lift your hips up towards the sky. Bring your elbows, yeah, down to the earth. Clasp your hands at the small of your back. Walk your shoulders underneath you. Press your fists down into the earth. Press the back of your head into the earth. Five, four, three, two, one. With control, lower down. Take a breath in. Exhale it out. And then set it up again. Bridge, you know where to go. You were just there. Or wheel, if that's in your practice, go there. It's your Saturday. It's your choice. Rise up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. With control, lower down. One breath in. One breath out. And then again, rise up. Bridge, wheel. Bring your best, bring your biggest breath, your best breath, generous breath, and then slowly lower down. One breath in, one breath out, and then last one right here, bridge or wheel, rise up, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower down with control. Take Supta Baddha Konasana. Bring the soles of your feet together. Let your knees spread wide. <coughs> bring one hand to your heart, one hand to your belly. Let your eyes gently close. Feel your breath. Feel your heartbeat. Breathe in deeply. Feel your belly rise to meet your fingertips. Take in a full body stretch. Full body stretch. Get big. Take up space. Reach. Point your toes. Flex your feet. Hug your knees into your chest. Give them a big squeeze. Rock from side to side. Rock and roll up and down your spine. Get some momentum going and come up to a high boat. Feet flexed, knees squeezing into center line, fingers reaching towards the fireplace, heart lifting towards the sky. Lower halfway down for low boat. Extend your right leg high towards the sky. Flex your foot, shoulders off the earth. Left foot flexing, pulse towards your right foot. Reach your fingers. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Come back to low boat. Left leg lifts. Flex both feet. Pulse ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Legs both up, high boat. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Low boat, five, four, three, two, one. High boat, five, four, three, two, one, and lower down, five, four, three, two, one, full body stretch, reach fingers, reach toes, 
Breathe in. Breathe out. And make your way to downward facing dog. That was crazy. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> downward facing dog. It's a love hate affair. Love hate love affair. <laughs> Right foot, lift it strong and straight back behind you. Flex that foot. Bend your knees, stack your hips, open up before you come into half pigeon. Right knee to right wrist. Right knee to right wrist to let your shin drape across the top of your mat. And then work to stack your front toe bones. So your front toe, can you stack your big toe over your pinky toe? Can you stack your front toe bones? Stack your front toe bones. Use a block underneath your right hip if you need to get your toe bones stacked. Yeah. Yeah. Stack those toe bones. Press your pinky toe edge of your foot into the earth. And then when you're ready, walk your fingers forward, take sleeping pigeon. Bring your forehead down to the earth or a brick could feel good. found that when I do a thing and I do it to be of service to someone or something else, possibly something that's bigger than me, it makes the thing that I'm doing much more enjoyable, almost effortless, because I am gifting my effort to someone, something. So can you offer up the sensations that you're feeling in this pose, the openness? the gravity that you're feeling in your body. Can you gift that? Imagine you're sending this energy, the sensations that you're feeling. Can you gift that in your mind to someone, to something, doing this work for them, sending them your effort, your ease? And notice, does that change how the pose feels in your body? Does it open up? Does it change? Does it shift? Bring your fingertips back up onto your mat. Tuck your left toe. Take a three-legged dog with your right leg high. Downward facing dog. Big breath in. Exhale it out. Lift your left leg strong and straight. Prepare all the preparatory movements. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Feel that opening. Then half pigeon left side, left knee to left wrist. Stack those front toe bones. And for your left thigh, can you bring it straight? Yes, there you go. Straight out of your hip socket. Press down through the pinky toe edge of your left foot. And then when you're ready to soften, crawl your fingers forward. Being of service to others also opens you up to being connected. 
It allows for space, for connectivity between other human beings and for connectivity between you and your own human body. As you notice your body sensations, that creates a deeper connection between your awareness and your physicality. You become aware of cause and effect and how what thoughts you're thinking change how you feel. Bring your fingertips back up onto the mat. Tuck your back toe, take a three-legged dog, kick your left leg back. Take some hip circles, take some knee circles, whatever feels good after a half pigeon. And then come down to your knees and set up for an inversion practice of your choice. It can be waterfall pose with a brick underneath your tailbone. It can be headstand, handstand, forearm stand, anything to get your hips above your heart. Waterfall pose, you put your oh, brick underneath your sacrum. Feet flexed straight up towards the sky. You can float in space and bring your fingertips up towards the sky. And press up through your heels as you flex your feet. slow, steady breaths. Slowly begin to lower your legs down towards the earth. Taking a full body stretch, reach your fingers, reach your toes, flex your feet. Then hug your right knee into your chest, give it a big squeeze, supine twist. Left hand takes right knee across your body. Right arm comes out like a wing, send your gaze towards your right thumb. And soften here. Soften here. Come back to center, right leg, bring it out long. Hug your left knee in, give it a big squeeze. <coughs> Supine twist, opposite side. Come back to center. Hug both knees into your chest. Take happy baby. Grab the outside edges of your feet. Kick your feet towards the sky. Press your tailbone down into the earth. Press the back of your head down into the earth. Rock from side to side. Maybe extend one leg long. Then the other leg long. Take a half happy baby. Keep your right hand on your right foot. Extend your left leg long on the mat. 
Press your heel down into the earth and pull back on your right foot. Maybe you rock a little from side to side. Take your left hand to your left hip as a guide. Left hand to left hip to press it down into the earth. Gentle reminder. And then switch sides. Half happy baby with left foot pulling in. Flex that foot. Press your right heel down into the earth. Imagine you're dragging your right heel in towards your body to pull your right hip into its socket. So dragging your heel in towards your body. Find a little movement. Bring both knees in. One more happy baby with both feet up towards the sky. Slowly release your feet down towards the mat. Bring your feet wide. <coughs> Bring your arms down by your sides, palms up towards the sky. Let your eyes gently close. Let your breath return to normal. Let your tongue fall away from the roof of your mouth. And let your teeth slightly part. And let go of all of the gripping, all of the controlling. With each out breath, let your body soften, soften more.
taking the biggest breath you've breathed in in a long time right here. Hold it at the top. Lion's breath out. Open your mouth. Stick out your tongue. Let it go. Make some noise. Again, breathe in. Make some noise. And again, fill up. Empty out. Roll over onto your favorite side and then cradle your head and your arms. Bottom arm becomes a pillow. And do a full body scan right here from the crown of your head. Noticing your eyebrows, your ears, your nose, your chin, your neck, shoulders. Scan all the way down your body, belly button, hips, thighs, knees, shins, ankles, the soles of your feet. <coughs> Slowly press yourself up to seated at the top of your mat, hands at heart center, sitting tall. Thank you for showing up today. You showed up today for you, for your neighbors, for your community. I appreciate that. Honor yourself for the work that you have done of just coming here and getting on your mat. And we'll close with one ohm. Take a big breath in. Oh. to the center of your forehead, touch in. And the light and love in me bows and honors to the light and love in each and every one of you. Namaste.